Okay, I'm going to show you how to put the Roomba robotic floor vac, specifically the Roomba Pro Elite, into diagnostic test mode so you can figure out what's wrong with it. First you hold down all at the same time the S, the M, and the L. Make sure they're firmly held down because if they're not, this thing's going to take off on you. And hit the power button. Wait a few seconds. You'll hear that sound. You'll see that the light starts to cycle between green, yellow, orange, and red. Kind of rainbow-like. But it cycles through, so now it's in the test mode. And to move it through the test mode, you're going to hit L for each different test. So I'm going to turn it up like this so you can see it. And the first thing I'm going to do is hit the L button. That puts it in the beginning test phase. L again. This is checking the lights on the front. So you keep pushing the L until you get to the different test mode. This is the wheels going one direction. That's L. Wheels going the other direction. L. The brushes. Here, that's the vacuum running. L. Little side brush test. Now, after it goes through all these motor tests, then you get into the test of the sensors. So, press L again, and it may be different on yours. Press it until when you lift it up, these two lights go on here, put it down, they go off. And you'll see, if you lift it up and then you cover, these are the sensors down here, and you cover the sensors, you'll see how it goes out. That means the sensor's working. This is the next one, goes out, means it's working. If I put them both, cover them both, closed. So, move to the next phase, and now it's looking at these other two sensors on the, the right side. And apparently mine has a bad right sensor because when I put something over it here, it's not, it's not going off. So mine has been acting erratic, going around in circles and doing crazy stuff. So it looks like that's bad on mine. So that's it. When you want to turn it off, hit the power button again.